Hello everyone and how are you today? My name is Lizzie Wei and I'm going to be teaching you how to make your own weighing scale, also known as a balance scale. But before we get started, I'm going to tell you a little joke. It goes like this. How do you weigh fish? It's easy because they all come with scales. Did you get that? Anyway, I'm going to move on to show you what you need to make your own weighing scale. You need to have a masking tape, some string, a container, a ruler, a pen, and some items that can help you to measure the correct width as well as a pair of scissors to cut your string. So you're first going to make a mark on your cup. You need your tape, you need your ruler to help you make a mark in the correct place. So once you have made a mark, you need to make sure that this mark is, the other mark is exactly in the same place as, the, as this mark. So I'm going to use my toothpick to push through to the other end. Like this. Okay. I'm going to make my next mark on the other side, opposite direction and push my skewer across the opposite direction like that. Once you are done, you then need to measure your string. For my balance scale, I measured 30 centimeters by two, which is the size of the ruler. And I just folded it up like this and cut it. You're then going to use your string to push it through the holes that you have made. You need two strings so that you have, um, your, your weighing scale has good balance. Once you have pushed through your two strings, you are then going to tie your balance scale at the top. Like this. Once you have tied your balance scale, this is how it's going to look like when it is complete. Of course, you can use your cellar tape to join your containers or your string together like this. So once you have completed, you need your coat hanger as well as somewhere to hang your coat hanger. You may want to use your door handle or you may want to use a chair. You are then going to walk around your house and collect objects that you would like to weigh. You can then compare the objects to see which one weighs more and which one weighs less. Let's see, I've got a bottle cock as well as a pom-pom. As you can see, the cock weighs more because the side of the one that weighs more always goes down, just like a seesaw. 
I hope you have had fun making your own balancing scale and you can go ahead and explore, look around your house, find items that you would like to wear and compare. Sometimes the object might weigh, might weigh the same, same, sometimes one might weigh more than the other. I hope you have fun. Bye.